bienvenidos a su canal Vera Jules. Mi nombre es Ana y el día de hoy les traigo un lote de joyería que compré de un um, vendedor local. Y él se dedica a, a um, limpiar casas eh, de um, muebles, eh, de todo lo que tengan adentro. Okay. Y uh, me ha vendido la joyería a mí. So, estoy muy contenta. Eh, le, vamos a ver qué es en este segundo lote. Este es el segundo lote que compro de él. Um, tengo un tercer lote que les voy a enseñar más adelantito. Okay. Este lote que les voy a enseñar el día de hoy me costó 70 dólares. Um, hay bastantes cosas, so uh, vamos a ver hasta dónde podemos llegar. So today I had a 70 dollar lot that I got from a local seller. Um, I'm very happy about the connection that I made. Uh, this guy is um, he cleans houses, cleans out houses in. Uh, he sells me the jewelry. Um, he, I think he sells antiques and something else. So I'm very happy about this. Um, okay, so let's start. Okay. Um, vintage, almost all are vintage. So um, vintage lot. This is a pair of hoops. Uh, these are probably they were um, gold plated uh, I see the finish is coming off or wearing off uh, but I don't see any markings okay hoops which edge hoops this is just dependent okay it's missing the chain it's kind of like a double spiral uh, pendant as you can see okay gold tone also uh, we have some single earrings here silver tone white hoops and they have a heavy coating I am not sure but I think it's a key um, maybe i'm not sure i don't see anything else i see a little mark inside of the white hoop in here that looks like a key but i am no 100 percent because it's a heavy cotton maybe a rhodium plate Very nice um, black um, let's see if I can fix it. it's supposed to be here okay will be onyx yep or oh, glass it could be glass um I am not sure if this part maybe they are 
Mary because um, maybe not uh, the the hook they, they look like an antique gold color But the, the cone cups, they look like a different colors, so maybe they are no, but um, this part and this uh, setting here, uh, they, they look like the same color, but the hooks kidney hooks they look different they look like a golden um, like a gold tone so I'm not so sure if they are original backings and we got these pearls pins we actually got three of them I see three of them. Um, these backings have a maybe a chain was attached to it. Okay, and this one too. They look plastic pearls. Actually, these look alike. This one is a little short on the stem. I see some broken things. Let's see this one. Oh, very nice. Silver tone earring. Um. Kidney hooks and these are foil rhinestones with open backs on um, purple purple foil back pure shape. I think these are crystals. Maybe it's just Aurora Borealis finish on top of it. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Like the rhinestone. Uh, they have no markings. I think it's just silver tone okay. um, 
screw box and we got these ones also kidney stones green rhinestones on gold tone they look like um, gold plated they are no mark And the see the dangle. Very nice. It has a little pull on the levers or the backing, so I think they are cold plated. Oh, look at this. A medallion, this is a charm. A gold tone. And it has um rhinestones blue in yep and I can see the tips where the the tips of the uh, I call those ay, 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 I forgot um, the prongs are um, uh, the finish is completely off and some are broken also you can feel them um, I was wondering if they have removed the the stones and maybe that is why the prongs are I don't think so I think the prongs are just decoration okay it's a cool tone medallion charm um, family tree maybe Oh, they are gold feel. Uh, is it Wells? Yeah, Wells 14k gold feel. Let's see if the packings are original. Doesn't say anything. Back, that packing doesn't say anything, but then this packing is different. Hey, hey. Um. Mm. 
doesn't say anything. And this one, yep. This, they are very dirty though. But they are gold filled. Change the buttons. Now look at this. These are uh, earring jackets. Um, so these work this way. You can add something. Mm, yeah. Here we go. Just like an extra. Very nice. These are like a. Uh, hoops, uh, kind of like a um, square shape. Um, they look very um, dirty and. They are not heavy though, but they are heavy coated. They have a coating on that is very thick. Okay. Got these earrings. Oh. I see they have a add packing. Look at that. So when you, I don't remember what is the name of this. These are are these jackets also? The gold jackets. Okay. So the packing is attached. So when you it like this it comes to be as a hoop chain hoop now this uh, There's no markings in it. To me, they look like, um, no. I thought that may be gold, but they are not. They look, like the finish is rubbing off. Yep, they are maybe gold feel. They have no mark. That's gold feel. Oh, look at these ones. These are beautiful, beautiful, beautiful earrings. Oh, this style. Look at that style. Um. Like a stamp, um, metal. I don't know what is the difference. Uh, I mean, uh, I know what it is the difference, but I don't know how to tell the difference on a stamp or cast metal. Look at the pattern on this. I don't know if you are able to see it. Let's see if I can. No. I don't know if you are able to see this. Okay. It's beautiful. It's stamping. Okay. And 
it has a prong foil back a stone it looks like um brass At least the bottom part, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. all of it, yeah, it's the same. I don't see any markings on it though. Let's see the backings. No marks on that one either. Um, this is oh yeah. Maybe they have no brass. Just metal. They are nice though. Very nice. I like them. They look uh, antique design to me. their model Look at these ones Ooh, these are jet these are Yet, I don't know if you are able to see. But I need to mark right here. Oh, yeah, right here. Okay. Another market jet. Ooh, nice. I like it. It has gold tone cups. Um, a rondel. A filigree um, beer and this um, I don't think they are original they don't look the same tone I think Very nice. I like it. I don't know if I want to keep them like this though. This. I don't know. I think they will look better on a maybe on a kidney stone. Um, kidney stone. A <laughs> kidney. Um. Hook. I think they will look better. Anyways, I like it. I don't know. Those cups look like old to me. I don't think they are though. They could be. They could be. I don't check on that. Then we have this. Oops. Um, silver tone maybe silver plated but I don't think so they are just silver tone hoops oh 
I see some single earrings. Then we got this chain with initials. Let's see what initials. I, I maybe not initials. I think they are use scrolls. chain I think this is just a yeah it's the mother no mother but a gold tone metal chain and the um little plate is also Okay, I see back in Erin no markings. We have this um pearl single single earring. Okay. Mm. I think this is the nope. I thought they were a match, but they are not. I look at this one. This is a three pearl. It's plastic. Very nice though. Single earring. We got some more single earrings here. That I will try to find a match on the other boxes. in this box now this box is heavy I think this box is metal cover and it says Buxton ah, a lot of trash a pearl maybe was a peeling I think these are Peeling. And let's see. Yep. So you can see the boxes Buxton. Look at all the earring places. Very nice. Just need cleaning them. But I have a single shape. Yep. This is Buxton made in USA. This box is in really good shape. Okay. Oh, I forgot. Okay, so we got this earring jackets. We got this single earring here with a ring and a and a flower. Okay. A gold tone metal. Look at this beautiful earring. There's a flower. It's missing some of the rhinestones. They are blue color and it's missing a lot. Two, four, six, and the hello. Okay. I don't see any markings on this. Look at the depth. Very nice. Um, this is 
rhodium plated very heavy rhodium plated and I don't see any markings that's a beautiful earring, earring. clip on earring uh, look at this one this one is missing some seed beads okay oh I see a marking on this Holy craft. It's Mark Holy craft. And it's missing. Let me see. Oh, it's not missing anything. It's just the colors. The enamel paint is over the pearls, so that's why it looks like the pearls are missing, but everything is in there. And these little rhinestones in here are like pinkish color so they also look um, seem to be missing but they are all over there very nice earring a lot then we got this one enamel cover metal with a gold tone Bolton um, wire. In this one, just um, gold enamel. Now, this is a, bro a brooch. Okay. I don't know if you are able to see the sparkle. On this one there's a diamond in there uh, I don't know if you are able to see the sparkle but it's just beautiful sparkle um, and this is a 25 pin 25 year pin and actually is H and A I think it is and it is um, um, it's not monogram. How you call this? Oh my goodness! I forgot. I forgot how you call this. Um, But it has the name of the person in the back. Phyllis L. Hanaburi. I don't know if I am butchering the last name, but this is a pin of um, anniversary of work. And information uh, is a H and D and this is for a law firm in Boston okay the name of the law firm was Hell and Door and existed from 1918 to 2004 and this one is marked with the name and a date 2-16-53 this person okay phyllis was a ay, 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 what, what she was okay let's see if i can get this book. i print it out uh secretary legal secretary she worked as a legal secretary at the firm and she was retired in 1985 she got this pin before that so if it is 53 53 um anyways and i got um all the information okay now 
all of these stones are um, real stones. I see, I see a ruby, a diamond, uh, amethyst, a sapphire, and I think it's a citrine, and the other one. I think it's a topaz. Oh, and an aquamarine right here. It has three, six, seven stones. And this is silver. It's no mark silver, but it's, it te tests as silver. Okay. I think it's just beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Okay. Let's proceed. I'm very happy with that one. Now we got another little box. Look at these ones. These are enamel um, painted apples. This has a little taint dent in here not dent scratch okay little scratch in here but besides that look at how they look a yellow apple and a red apple and i don't see any markings and i think these are Maybe pewter and or maybe cast metal. I am not sure. Mm. They have no markings. And let me show you. Let me see if I can show you how big they are um, one and a half inches long and one and one quarter wide width they are just beautiful. I love them. Love them, love them, love them. We have this pin that says Sagahea, is this in Haverhill, Massachusetts? And I don't see any other markings. In the pin to see if some of these sometimes are cool, but I don't think this is. Okay, now this is a loose side. Um, key ring. Mossy house at Mossy home. Oh no, model home. Model home. This is plastic. And we have a silver tone ch chain that is broken. It is missing the other end of the clasp oh yeah look at these earrings gold tone with 
um, glass. Open. No, this. Yeah, this are open back. Okay, and have a hello of clear rhinestones. They are heavy, beautiful though, they are heavy. No markings. No markings. Okay. This is enamel backing over metal. Enamel cover metal backing black number. Look at that. Look at those fine stones. Isn't this beautiful? Just stunning. I love that black. Mm. No markings. No markings. But it's beautiful. And those fine stones, I mean, they look beautiful. Glass. Um, I think they are just glue in, and actually, the rhinestones are let me see is that the glue or the foil mm, maybe it's the glue the glue is the one that looks a little yellow okay now look at this one those are beautiful uh, this is riveted in has a little movement but I think it's because of the rivet not because it's supposed to or maybe it is hmm. oh, no. I don't think it's supposed to have any movement This is heavy rhodium plated, so I don't see any markings on this. Look at that. That's a beautiful, that's a beautiful brooch. Stunning. I want to show you these ones. Look at these earrings. All are, well, no, but all the big stones are open back. Okay. I have Marquis Pink. I have one uh, Chaton in green, one in blue, and one in, uh, I don't know if it is pink or it is clear, but is less pink than the marquise and then we have some aurora borealis finish on the little ones and some clear ones the same over here we have a two clear ones and one aurora borealis pink um i think they are on, I'm not sure, but I think they are, um, it's cold tone, anyways, I'm not sure how old these are, um, if you have any information on what you see, I would like your input on it, um, 
these are beautiful these are all open back the big ones and the small ones are a close back see you can see the light through it these are just stunning I love them love them love them love them very much the colors are very nice pink clear Oh, this one look more like salmon color, yellow color than, than pink. Okay, now I'm going to show you these other ones. My God, is this, this is just beautiful. These are all rhinestones. They are all close back in a gold tone look at that and that's beautiful oh. they have some blue and light blue combination okay. let's approach a this brooch oh I see okay this is I think it could have been used as a as a pendant also This was supposed to be used as a pendant to but okay there you go. Yep, like this. Okay. Look at that. In gold tone with um, blue rhinestones very nice I don't see any markings no markings this looks 50s to me maybe a windmill has some atomic design but then with windmill over here and a flower in the middle so I'm not sure what they were going for on that one now look at this one Ooh, it is just stunning milk glass with um, rhinestones, pink rhinestones, look at that combination. Very big, this must be like two inches, I think. Yep, two inches. Okay, and no markings has some dimension on it look at that these are big uh, marquis very nice very high tone and a gold tone 
metal and no markings we got this bracelet okay half open heart link together No markings on this. missing the other end of the clasp yep where did I put the one that is broken get right here ok then we got this one it's a, a profile and it is Mark Rosecraft Sterling Silver in the card in it this is sterling auto made that's what it says sterling auto made ones just look like silver to me um, like that. I think it's a bridge I think it's a cover bridge No markings. Mm. One of the mm, maybe the two of them. One has more pull than the other one. So maybe they are not silver. missing I think this one is another pro but over here I'm not sure what it was it has a little cartridge that says made in West Germany that's what it says I don't think 
think this is silver it although it looks like silver but I don't think it is but I'm not sure if they made some silver Definitely this one is no mark. So maybe it's not. And it's too bad that it's missing the stones. Oh, and I see some finer stones in that. Then we got these little earrings with cameos. sure if this is a I don't know I don't know what this are. I see some carbon in it but I I'm not sure This is like a stamp metal. Interesting. This one's okay. enamel paint, and I think these are celluloid, maybe. I think it's celluloid. Cast metal. Um. No, no marking. Yeah, no markings. Somebody's playing with a kid outside of my porch, so that's still noisy you here. Okay, this is rhodium plated initial. A G, a I, or a J. Okay, and I think it's an I, or maybe a J. Rhinestones, but it's one missing in here, right here. There's only one missing. Yep. Okay, then we got this. Swank um, gold tone, maybe gold field, but it's no mark. 
No, I don't think so. I think it's just gold tone. And definitely this one gonna have the pull because of the spring in here. Okay. I think those are just glass stones. Glass stones. Look at this. These are glass. Mm. Aurora Borealis finish. And then. Silver tone and very Markings, look at that. Look at the backs. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, then I got these two little pins, scatter pins. Um, yeah, this one for that reason doesn't get to it. These are hmm. I thought they were shell. But now I'm not sure. Are they moon glow? Look at that. It's two of them. And ouch. Has a C clasp. Okay. And a long pin. Uh, they don't stick that much out, but they. And they have a stop, a pin stop. I think they are, oh my god, I don't know what they are. It look like shell to me. Okay. Now, look at this. Unfortunately, this one broke. But the two pieces are here, so I may just fix it. And if I sell it, will disclose that I fix it, that I glue the pieces. Okay. 
I see an indentation here and I don't know if it is. Oh yeah, it's a broken piece. Oh, we have another neck over here. Oh my goodness. This is Kara China Staffordshire made in England. Okay. This is just beautiful. I don't know how old this is. But to have only those two little nicks and the breaking is spectacular. Oh, now we are in an hour and I still have a box to go. No, I have more than one box. So I may stop in here and um, continue with the other on a new video. This is an agat a pendant okay, with a cup, a cup <laughs> filigree cup. Look at this shape. Very nice. And we will stop here. Um, don't forget to sign up. Uh, give me a thumbs up. If you like the content of the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And also, if you want to be notified for when new content is uploaded to the channel, don't forget to hit the notification bell. Thank you.